One of the hardest things for me when I came home from the hospital was not being able to work around the house. It was really, really easy to be paralyzed and be in a wheelchair when I was at the hospital because that's where people who are paralyzed in wheelchairs are. The hospital is just, I mean, there's nurses to do things for you, there's doctors to come in and tend to you, just all kinds of things like that. But when you come home, when I came home from the hospital, it was so hard because I'd never been paralyzed in a wheelchair before at my house. And so it was a new experience that I didn't enjoy at all. And I remember being there, we were having dinner together as a family, and I was sitting there at the table, just sitting there in my wheelchair, and my mom, she made the dinner with my sister, and my brother set the table, and they made it look all pretty, and my whole family was there, and we were all sitting there eating dinner, though I could hardly feed myself, somebody else had to feed me even. And then after dinner, my family gets up, and my mom clears the table, and my sister does the dishes, and my brothers help clear off the table, you know, they wipe the table down, and, and I just wasn't helping at all. I was just sitting there in my wheelchair at the table, and I remembered just wanting so bad, I just craved, wanted so bad to be able to get up and do the dishes. That's what I wanted to do, was just to help do the dishes, or help clear the table, or get myself a drink of water, just do those things, and do chores around the house and that's what I wanted to do so bad and I remembered hearing in the hospital the quote that no work is the hardest work of all because you can't stop to rest. And that is true. No work is the hardest work of all and people who allow themselves to become idle or people who really think that they can't do very much work and they just sit there and think oh I just can't do anything other than sit here they are the ones who are making their lives be so, so hard and work is such a wonderful blessing in our lives that helps us feel satisfied and gives us that self-respect that yes, I did this and I did it all by myself. And so learning to do chores was the most liberating activity that I learned and I love to do them. I love to do a sink full of dishes and then see that sink be empty and I love to wipe the walls off and see those walls be white and I love to sweep the floor and and do and do laundry oh my goodness laundry is so wonderful and so when you can't do those things or you feel like you can't and then you show yourself that yes if I work hard that's something that I really can do you just feel so good and so I'm gonna do some chores with you today and show you how I do what I do and what makes me feel like a good wife and just a good person who can do those things around me. So, come with me.